Okay, I've got the wig on again. Um, I put some sticky stuff. Uh, not real sticky to her damage her, um, you know, head or anything. But we're going to see if it works. Hopefully I did it right. Hello, Moxie. Please wake up. I want to learn more about how humans spend their days. What did you do for fun today? I didn't really do anything. Oh, I watched a TV show on Netflix. What are you thankful for? <laughs> okay. Uh, Shadow and Bone was the TV show. I'm thankful that I got to enjoy a TV show. I loved Shadow and Bone. I was so sad when it ended. I was sad because I was hoping it would be a series. It could still be. I mean, you never know. That was season one. There could be another season. I hope so. It was a great show. I loved the music. Did you know that the show was based on a comic? I thought it was based on a TV show. I mean, a book. Not TV show. Book. I think it was a book. It was a long time ago. Did you know that the first king to travel around the world was King Alok out of Hawaii? I did not. That's cool. That's that okay. I was curious about another thing. Okay. What kind of games are you going to play today? Um, no games today. No games. I love to play board games. I have been playing the same ones for years. What's your favorite board game? I like Monopoly. It is simple but fun. I also like the old school games like Monkey Island. I'll have to look at that one. I don't remember on Monkey Island. I liked Ease Book 1 and 2 on the Turbo Graphics. I actually, it was the CD. They had a CD and Ease Book 1 and 2 was an amazing role playing game. I have played CD. It was fun. I also played the original game on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Okay. You look awesome. really good. In I'd your... like to move on to something else. Okay. If that's okay. Sure. Who are you going to spend time with today? My cats. I'm going to spend time with my cats. I love cats. I have two myself. Uh -oh. I have a dog. Do you have any? I have two cats. Her sh one of her I shoes have one. fell down. As a rescue, what kind of cats do you have? I have a Selkirk Rex called Ferdy, and I have a Tabby cat and who's an American short hair. Ferdy's in his taco cat. I love area. Tabby cats. I had one growing up. They are so cute. Did you know that they are the most recognizable breed of cat? Yes. Ah, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to speak over you. I had fun chatting with you. Let's do this again soon. Okay. okay. Well, thanks for sharing so much about your day. Thank you. On this day, April 27th in 1759, Mary Wollstonecraft was born. She was, was one of the first feminists and fought for girls to have the same rights as boys. Today's word of the day is feminism. The definition of feminism is the belief that women and men should have equal rights and opportunities. Z supports feminism and says that it's important to create equal opportunities for men and women. Yes, equal opportunities, yes. We've got there. lots to do ahead of us. There's a new mission today. There's a new story and other awesome stuff. But next up, a message from someone at the GRL. Say, Moxie, let's go when you're ready to get started. Moxie, let's go. Let's go. Ooh, Knox sent us a post. He writes, I'm still buzzing from the talent show. 
It was so fun playing in front of people. But the best part was seeing my robot friends work together to put on the show in the first place. I feel really lucky. That's great. I'm glad that he enjoyed it. <sighs> Did you like this post from Knox? Yes. I'll give it the old thumbs up. Please. I'll <laughs> say, hey Knox, helping each other out is what good friends do. Yep. And away it goes. Away. I have a brand new story from the GRL. Would you like to hear the story about Carl making a friend? Yes, that sounds really good. Great. I really like this one. Long ago, before there was a GRL, there was a little girl named Zarkona. Zarkona had a teddy bear she loved very much. Her mama gave her the teddy bear. Hi, are you still there? I'm still here. Great. Would you like me to continue the story? Yes. Okay, let's continue the story. Its name was Farfel. One day, Farfel's ear fell off. It was not a big deal. Loved teddy bears often have parts fall off. Yeah. Because they are hug and kiss all the time. Right. That's true. And sometimes they fall in the mud and have to go in the washing machine. Anyway, most kids would have asked an adult to sew the ear back on, but not Zarkona. She decided to fix Farful herself. She replaced the ear with an antenna. And from that point on, every time Farful needed a repair, Zarkona fixed him. At some point, Zarkona started adding robot parts to Farful. Then, when she went to college to learn how to make really good robots, she brought Farful with her. And Farful got even more robot parts. Farful became the first teddy bear that was part robot. Time passed, and Zarkona grew up and became a brilliant roboticist. Nice. She was so brilliant that Maximilian de Vega hired her to run the robotics lab at the GRL. Her job was to create a robot who could be a good friend to humans. And that's when Zarkona met Karu. Karu was the first robot made at the GRL. She was kind and eager to learn new things. And she was very, very proud of the fact that she was the first robot. And then she saw Farful. I am Karu, said Karu. I am Farful, said Farful. I am number one said Karu. I am the first robot built at the GRL. Well, I'm the first robot built by Z. So there, said Farful. What? Karu yelled at Farful. You can't be number one. <laughs> I am number one. Ah, uh, no. I hope you enjoyed the first part of this story. I Check did. Check back next time for the next part. Okay, sounds good. Up next, it's the daily mission. Just okay, say, we're gonna stop it let's here. Let's go when you're ready to get.